When someone says Hawaii, what do you think of? Sand, surf, sun? For most of us, when we think Hawaii, we think pineapple. Joining us now with this week's Ag Minute is Kristen Oaks. And Kristen, for us this week, it has been a total week of pineapple consumption. After this week, I don't know if I want to taste any anymore. After the first bite of Craig Bowden's juicy sweet pineapple, it was good and you could see why it was one of Hawaii's top treasures. But after the sixth and seventh bite, well, I quickly realized why you could really have too much of a good thing. Here in Hawaii, nothing says aloha better than a sweet golden pineapple. A symbol of hospitality, the pineapple has welcomed visitors to the island since the 15th century. It was taken as a, a, a very prized gift from different places in the world back to the old world. And so it, and the image of the pineapple is often used to greet people as a symbol of aloha. Craig Bowden should know a thing or two about the aloha fruit. For more than 20 years, he's grown his Hawaiian crown pineapples from fruit right here in Hawaii. So those are actually going to be pineapples, and each plant produces only one flower. That becomes actually the fruit that we all eat and enjoy. Sounds easy enough, right? Well, not quite. It takes 18 months for this plant to produce a ready-to-eat fruit. From there, each pineapple is harvested and boxed by hand. Farming in Hawaii is not an easy proposition. It's an expensive place to do business. We pay a lot of money for the land. We pay a lot of money for the water. But it's Hawaii's lush land that makes his fruit so darn good. What it takes to make a good pineapple is good soil, abundant sunlight, you know, long enough days that you can get the sugar content up in the in the fruit. So I needed to find out just how good are his Hawaiian crown pineapples. Oh my gosh, that is delicious. Little did Craig know, pineapple was my favorite fruit. <laughs> you can tell she likes it. 10 minutes and an entire pineapple later. I just needed to learn how to say Tums in Hawaiian, but it sure did taste good. Now the moral of this Hawaiian story is never take a hungry pig to a field of their favorite food because they just might founder on you. Well, now it's time for our Twilight Trivia. Last time I asked you, in Italy, what do people wear for good luck on New Year's Day? And the answer is A, red underwear. For the first Twilight Trivia of this year, Hawaii is the only state that produces which commodity? Is it A, pineapples, B, bananas, or C, coffee beans? Log on to our website, twilatv.org, submit the correct answer, and we'll send one winner a gift pack of a lot of goodies that we found while in the Aloha State. Well, Mike, I'm sure you'll be the first in line to get some of those sweet pineapples. You are absolutely correct, and that's followed closely by the macadamia nuts. Kristen Oaks, another fascinating Ag Minute. A lot more to come on this week in Louisiana agriculture, including Louisiana farm leaders step up to the national stage. All that when we come back. Stay with us. <laughs> 